Hey guys, I hope you've all had a super awesome day. It's Mansell here, and we're also joined by Baby Andreas. And in this review, we're going to be checking out the 2016 Comic Con exclusive Cedar Wood. And I just want to say a huge thank you to Mattel for sending me her. And I also can't wait to show you her because she is absolutely amazing. And she's also the third release in the Ever After High line for Comic Con. And the first one that was released way back in 2014 was Cerise Wolf. And this Raven Queen was released in 2015. And this is the box that it comes in, and it has a red curtain on the front with a spotlight there in the centre. And we can see Cedar's hand there poking through the curtain. And I've just removed the outer packaging, and this is the beautifully detailed box that Cedar comes in. And it's been designed like a stage. And we even have Jiminy Cricket there in the top right hand corner. And at the very top it says Cedar Wood. And right down at the bottom it says Daughter of Pinocchio. And on the side we have some more detailed artwork, which includes a clock. And around on the other side we have some more carvings of a horse and a whale. And on the back we have a picture of Cedar. We also have a note from Cedar which says, Help, you see the marionette puppet on stage, the one that looks like me, while well, it is actually me, the real Cedar. The coachman from my future Pinocchio story put a magical curse on me and my friends that turned us all into puppets. I think he plans on handing us over to the evil queen. Lucky for us, I am already a puppet, which means the only one who has the power to help my friends escape. I've already tried a few times, but thanks to the coachman's curse, all I've got to show for it are a growing nose and a pair of donkey ears. I'm not giving up though, you see the chest on the side of the stage? There's a potion in there that will change us all back to students. If you can distract the coachman, I can get free and find the potion, and get my friends back to Ever After High, where we belong. And at the very bottom we have all the talented people that help create Cedar. The window of the packaging also lifts off to reveal more artwork. Which we had some marionette puppets there on the shelf. And on the other side it says now showing in San Diego, ever after high. It's in Hall H, the line begins here. And here is what you've been waiting for, the show is just about to begin. And here is Cedar Wood up close. As she's a marionette puppet, she's connected to all these strings. And at the top we have the two pieces of wood which the strings are attached to. And this helps operate her. And here's an up close look at her features, and she has orange and pink curly hair, and it's also purple there at the front, and it's been parted on the left hand side. She's also wearing a little gold hat, which has wave designs on it, as well as a little whale. And here is her donkey ears and her nose as mentioned in the story. She also has a wood pattern on her face, as well as freckles. She's wearing makeup as well, which includes a purple and silver eyeshadow, as well as a metallic silver and red lipstick. And check out the detailed outfit that she's wearing, it's just amazing. She's wearing a black top with these iridescent purple puffy sleeves. And over the top she's wearing a corset made from plastic, which is done in purple and gold, and it has a picture of cedar on each side as well as gold roses on the straps. And the dress that she's wearing has an impressive five layers of ruffles, and we have a pink one there with patterns on the top, and we have a metallic gold one under that, a black piece of tulle with glitter through it, and the very bottom layer is a plain black tulle. She's also wearing purple stockings with these giant pink bows attached. And her shoes are absolutely breathtaking, those are done in an antique gold, and they have flowers on the straps. And the heels are actually cuckoo clocks. And on the insides we have the Ever After High logo embossed on them. She's wearing these pink wristbands which have the string attached to them. She also has one attached to her leg. Okay hey guys, that was a look at the 2016 Comic Con exclusive Cedar Wood. I think she's absolute perfection, I love everything about her. Let me know if you feel the same way as well. Also a big thank you to Mattel for sending it to me. Look forward to reading all your comments guys, stay awesome and I'll catch you tomorrow.